Hi, this is Megan Dorsey with College Prep Results. This is an overview of my recent visit to St. John's College in Santa Fe, New Mexico. There are a few colleges in the United States that follow a Great Books curriculum as part of their liberal arts program, but St. John's College is one. It provides a unique approach to college geared towards the student who loves to read and wants to learn. St. John's has been featured in Colleges That Change Lives because of its remarkable impact on students. St. John's College in Santa Fe is located on 250 acres next to a national forest. It offers picturesque location minutes away from popular outdoor activities such as hiking, mountain biking, and skiing. St. John's is a small school with a little over 400 students, 85% of which live on campus. Most students come from out of state. St. John's is unique in that it has two campuses, one here in Santa Fe, New Mexico, and one in Annapolis, Maryland. Students have the option of switching campuses. St. John's most unique trait is its academic program, which is based on a study of great books rather than textbooks. St. John's offers only one major, liberal arts, and all students take the same classes over four years. Students read original works from some of the greatest minds in Western civilization. The full four-year reading list is available on their website. St. John's classes are small, often 12 to 20 students, and are all discussion-based. Instructors are referred to as tutors because unlike professors, they do not profess knowledge. Another unique trait at St. John's College is that students do not receive grades. Students have to participate in class, and most admit that the work is challenging. But there are no tests. Students are evaluated on their class discussion and written papers. At the end of every year, a student will meet in a conference room with their tutors, and the tutors will discuss a student's strengths and weaknesses and end the meeting by answering the question, should this student continue at St. John's? What do St. John's students do with their degrees? Well, most of them are very successful upon graduation. Graduates receive awards and major national fellowships. Employers find that Johnnies think critically and have excellent communication skills. And close to 70% of graduates pursue professional or graduate degrees after completing their work at St. John's. Campus life is unique. All freshmen are taking the same classes, even if they have different schedules or different tutors, and the same is true for all sophomores, juniors, and seniors, so there is a strong shared experience among the students. Students at the Santa Fe campus can often be found outdoors, taking advantage of the many activities available to them. St. John's doesn't participate in any intercollegiate sports, but students are participating in club and intramural sports and can often be found on the fields or at the athletic facility. How selective is admission to St. John's? Well, I can tell you that admission to St. John's, like much else of its program, is unique. A successful student should demonstrate through their written essays, teacher recommendations, and accomplishments that they would be a good fit for the school. St. John's is less concerned about grade point averages and standardized test scores, which are optional to submit, and are really looking more at a student's interests and desire to learn. Some successful St. John's applicants had mediocre grades in high school, often because they got bored with the work, but they're clearly able to demonstrate the ability and their interest. St. John's College in Santa Fe, New Mexico is a small school with a unique approach to higher education. It is a school that attracts bright students who want to learn and surround themselves with like-minded peers. St. John's is different from the typical college experience, but its students like it this way. For additional information, check out my blog at collegeprepresults.com.